What is close reading? Close, analytic reading stresses engaging with a text of sufficient complexity directly and examining meaning thoroughly and methodically, encouraging students to read and reread deliberately. Directing students' attention to the text itself empowers students to understand central ideas and key supporting details. It also enables students to reflect on meanings of individual words and sentences, the order in which the sentences unfold, and the development of ideas over the course of the text. This ultimately leads students to arrive at an understanding of the text as a whole. Students should be provided with multiple opportunities to interact with the text. As a result, a close reader reflects, reads, rereads, uses textual evidence, and focuses on author's purpose, what the author says, how the text flows, what the words mean, what the structure of the text tells them. At the secondary level, the following steps can ensure that students are provided the needed opportunities to engage with a complex text. First, read to get the gist. Then, ask learners these questions. What is the main idea? Can you summarize the text? What jumped out at you? What questions do you have? Second read, dig a little deeper. What text structures and text features were used? What is the author's purpose? How does the author feel about the topic? Why did the author use particular words and phrases? Third read, pull it together. What inferences can you make? How does the author support key parts? How does this relate to other texts you have read? How does this relate to your life? Educators build students' capacity for independently comprehending a text through close reading. The goal is to teach readers strategies by which they can pursue meaning independently. How do we start? Studying short texts is especially helpful to closely reading demanding texts. Allow students to a wide range of reading levels and lengths to practice closely reading demanding texts.